Welcome back, everybody! Last time we started running through the sewers and fought a giant monster. Now, today, we're gonna exit the sewers and get back to Sicilo Den. Where in Sicilo Den? I got no idea. It says the alley. Uh. Oh. <coughs> See how things look around Sicilo Den. Okay. I, I guess. Oh, there we go. You okay? Nope. Bregan? What are you doing here? When I heard the Snake Eyes had attacked, I figured you'd probably be headed this way sooner or later. Come on, it won't be long before they sniff us out. We need to find safer ground. What about the others we left behind? Mena can handle himself. Have a little faith. Come on, follow me. Just gotta believe he's gonna be okay. It's not gonna be a big deal, I would think. Alright, let's get to safety then, shall we? So this area is important for something. I knew it! Let me in. Let's go. Let's do this. What's gonna happen when we go in here? I don't know. How many of these hideouts do you guys have exactly? Enough. You can never be too careful these days. We even keep some of them secret from each other. So long as you don't let anyone tail you, you're welcome to use them as you please. So what's our plan of action? We're still going to rescue Zephyr, right? That goes without saying. If only we knew where he was, we could... Hey! You're gonna want to see this! Found guilty of all charges. The Calaglian dissident will forthwith be executed in witness of His Excellency Lord Ganabelt. Clause 2 of the Special Curfew Act has been initiated with immediate effect throughout the realm. All Danans not involved in special duties or corrective labor must remain indoors until further notice and watch the execution broadcast. Any citizens found in breach of this protocol will be arrested as dissidents. This is a direct order. Repeat, this is a you public announcement. you think they're talking announcement. about your friend? I would say but likely. Thought, but Law said, I thought we had days, not hours. Looks like it's been brought forward. Just hold on. Where do you think you're going? We don't even have a plan yet. Screw the damn plan! If we don't leave now, Zephyr's going to be murdered! Alpin, we've gotta go. The clock's ticking. <sighs> we've all gotta go some way, I guess. If you're gonna go, might as well go rescuing your friend, we'll right? We'll join up with you afterwards. We might be able to create a diversion. Good idea. Let's go. We have to get to the plaza. To the plaza we go indeed. What's going on? Why did the execution get moved up? Calm down. We don't know enough to say what's going on here. <sighs> We've got no way of knowing what happened to Menek and the others. Damn it. Hey, Zephyr and the others will be okay, right? Let's just get to the plaza and fast. After we sleep at the end, of course. I'm kind of tired of her, I recommend staying here so you can rest up and heal. Alright, let's do it. Cook before resting, nah. Let's rest up, get that CP back, get that HE back. You know, we're totally in a rush, but you know, we can always stop to take a, a, a five hour nap, right? Be careful when times are urgent, it's even more important to stay on top of your health so you don't make any mistakes. You never know when the bright eyes might snuff this place out, it's always best to prepare for the worst. True, true, and true. The execution is happening awfully quick, and is Gan about afraid reinforcements from outside will come to free Zephyr if he waits too long? Hmm, if he is, and he's pretty smart in that regard anyway. Hmm, pork. Once preparations are complete, we'll follow in after you. Good luck and be safe out there. Got anything new? <coughs> Let's see. That's no, there is nothing new for you either. Alright, you. I mean, think about it, but is it possible that raid happened because there's a mole among us? I doubt it, but who knows. I knew it. Those outsiders from Calaglia sold us out, didn't they? Um, hello. So what do you get for bringing a run into the fold? Shut up, I wouldn't say that if here if I were you. We are right next to you after all, you know? Hey, what's up? What's the point in broadcasting execution? Talk about overkill. Maybe Ganabelt felt 
feels like he needs to take drastic measures, but why? I wonder. Is he gonna say, can I run by you? Does Bregan seriously plan to take Rena head on? Even though there'll be snake eyes and armored soldiers armed and ready for us? It's now or never, as I always say. Yo, treasure chest with a life bottle, let's go! That's what I like to see. I like to see the life bottling happening. So good, so good. And now, into the back alley we go once again. We can figure out where to go, though, is the question. This is in Central Plaza. I see. Okay, well, I can't use fast travel, so I guess we're gonna... Oh, gosh. Even though this path is technically indoors, I feel like I'm going to freeze if I start. can't start the movie soon. Another day, another public execution. People are powerless to look away as it happens. Caliglian descendant. Did he come in from another territory before he got arrested? Yes. I'm watching. Jeez, I don't want to get arrested. Yeah, don't get yourself arrested. Just make sure you watch it. Watch it and be safe. Don't follow in his example, for you will die too if you do. And that's just how it is. I can be ran by the old hideout and there's literally no sign of the surrounding anymore. Was it ever a threat to begin with, I wonder? I do wonder indeed. Hey you. In lockdown, come to go and you're under arrest. Okay, so he's got nothing new to say, even though, literally, I'm not indoors when I'm supposed to be. Okay. Whatever. No big deal. You just do what you gotta do, and that's it. That's all there is to it. Hello there. Hello, soldiers. What's up? How's it going? Is the execution in there? Hey, you lot! Trespassers! Think the curfew doesn't apply to you, huh? Uh-oh. Now what? Beat him doesn't up. Doesn't seem like there's any other way in. I say we fight our way through. Wait! I recognize them! They were with the dissident! No choice then. Look sharp, everyone! Oh yeah, let's do this. Still okay, isn't he? The sooner we take care of these guys, the sooner we can rescue him. If you have time to talk, maybe you could focus okay. on the task at hand? How about you stop telling us what to do? So many freaking just suddenly like, oh yeah, well, like here's an art, uh, here's an art. There's an art for you too. Mega Sonic Thrust, a hard hitting, piercing hidden art that goes straight through an enemy, followed by another strike from behind. Eh, that sounds neat, but eh. Dragon Swarm, hidden art that at least a flurry is slashing or trying hard. Try some dragon swarm on for size. Alright, let's do that. Dragon swarm! Okay. I mean, it doesn't seem like the perfect move, but I mean, it, it can work. Flare tornado! Dragon swarm! It's like Sword and Alpha, but stronger? Boom! Got him! The accuracy does seem to leave a little bit to be desired, so maybe I don't want to use that regularly, but I don't know. Damn, there's just no end to these guys. Zephyr! Zephyr, you're gonna be okay, man. Watch out, dude! Whoa, it's a tower. Whoa, it's lights. Can we save him? Is he on the gallows? Or what, what is he on? Oh no, okay, that's not Attention, the gallows. Attention, citizens, subjects, and slaves of Cislodia. I, Lord Ganavelt Valkyris, do formally open these proceedings. Valkyris. Behold! The brazen worm who would dare threaten the peace and order of our fair city. As if his scheme weren't foolish enough, he then made the mistake of thinking he could hide it. Take heed, Danans, and engrave this edict into your souls. 
Such fools' right to life in Cisloria shall be forfeit. Now, Embedded, you should listen carefully. Before my final verdict, I am prepared to offer you an unprecedented chance at mercy. Where are your comrades? Give them up before those assembled, and I shall spare you your life. If you're so tremendously determined to suffer for the sake of your allies, then I will see to it that you do. First, tell the people about the mistakes you made. Then, the whereabouts of your friends. I wish I was a better father. Mistakes, huh? Where to start? I've made so many in my life that I've lost count. All my life I've had to fight, but I have known nothing but loss. I was so caught up in the struggle to survive in this world that I ended up neglecting my own family. I have lost so many good friends. I even lost my wife and my son. I'll never be able to fix these mistakes. Not a single one. It sounds to me as if the greatest mistake of your life was never learning to stay down when you were beaten. A good man once told me if I take up this fight, I'd have to pay a price. Turns out he was right. After all, the very people and things I was fighting to protect the most were payment. I don't regret keeping up the fight for a second. But still, not a single day goes by. But I do not think about what I have lost. Not telling others how much they truly meant to me before it was too late. That is your answer. That's the greatest mistake of my life. Do yourselves a favor and never become like me. Don't continue to make the same mistakes until it's too late to fix them. Ask yourself what it is you couldn't bear to lose. What do you want to protect with all of your might? Then hold on and never let go! That's quite enough. <sighs> Listen to that voice deep inside of you. Together, no wall can hold you back. And the same goes for the ones the Lord made you build inside your own hearts. Yo, there we go. You still hanging in there, Dad? Oh, you saved me. Damn you. I, I've been such an idiot. <laughs> I need to... Now's not exactly the best time to catch up. There. 
there's still a lord in need of beating. Yeah, you're right about that. So you're the son, are you? I thought I'd ordered for you to be relieved of your duties until all this was over. I'll see to it the person at fault is reprimanded appropriately. What? Oh, well. You've served your purpose more excellently than anyone could have hoped. <laughs> If it isn't the infamous Alphen of Calaglia. And he's joined by his fellow conspirators, the likes of Traitor and that Danon Witch. They're not conspirators. They're friends. And they're not alone. Oh, yeah. Oh, Minnick! You finally made it! Your reign is over right now. Hear me, Canabelt? <sighs> the Master Corps is acting up. What is it? Uh, Menic? <laughs> I was hoping to drag this out a little longer. But that's a Master Corps. What? Eh? <gasps> So the Master Corps react to each other, I see. How interesting. You can drop the act. It's over. All this time, it was really you? Every second. Okay, I, that's, that was unexpected. Hi! You <laughs> stand before the Lord of Cislodia, Ganabelt Valkyris in the flesh. You mean, a running lord's been leading the Danon resistance? You're not the only one skilled in the art of deception, you know. A mere side vocation in my own case, but sufficient in bringing the blazing sword of Calaglia to my host. <laughs> All of this was just to get to me? Alvin! Zephyr is... Dad! Dad! That's a special poison. Ordinary healing arts will do you no good. <laughs> Jeez. Can we not go through all this? Just as have him die anyway? Friends. You'll all be dead soon enough. Oh, here we go. Time to Don't fight! Don't even think of escaping, Dissident! We need to hurry. Otherwise, no, we're not getting out of here without a fight. No! No! Are you okay, man? <coughs> Overlimit? Okay. Um, as you take damage and execute perfect evasions, you'll enter Overlimit status for a set period. During it, arts cost no AG to use, and enemy attacks won't interrupt them. Be warned, however, enemies can also enter Overlimit status as well. Mystic Arts! Oh, here we go. While on Overlimit, after landing an art, press and hold down two of the following buttons to activate a character's powerful Mystic Art. Y, X, or and A. Once used, your character will no longer be in overlimit status. Alright. Bonk. I'm gonna freaking just spam some dragon swarm at you. There's no anime cut in for Mystic Arts in this game. That's so different. I don't recall there ever being a Tales game that didn't have like some kind of anime cut in for a Mystic Art. That's so weird. <coughs> All right, well that's uh, that's different anyway. Well, how do you know how close you are to getting Overlimit? Is it kind of like Symphonia where you don't really know for sure? I mean, I take that back. Symphonia, you kind of do actually know a little bit because you start to get this little bit of a faint glow around you. And all while we're on the defensive. But this game, you don't have anything. Come on. Stay with me! It seems. <laughs> All this trouble to buy yourself a few extra seconds before you die. <sighs> you bastard! You're just shooting the smoke, you know. 
<laughs> they fled. They'll be back, though. Draw up a welcome party. We'll be ready when they return. Jeez, I can't believe that guy was a freaking Renan Lord. Are you kidding me? Did, did we lose them? Looks like it for now. Come on, even if we did lose them, they'll be after us soon enough. Besides, we have Zephyr to worry about. The sooner we get back to the safe house, the better. <laughs> Is the safe house even safe? Zephyr. Let's get to the safe house, quick. <sighs> well, he's not aware of the safe house, but I mean, I would think being the leader of the Silver Swords that he would be aware of all the hideouts, but I mean, I don't know, that's so freaking weird to me. What the crud? You do have business in, in with you. Quick, I don't want eyes on me. Alright, alright. Hope we can save Zephyr, though, because... I still worry he's had a death flag on him this entire time. They even said normal healing arts won't work. Please, open your eyes! I'm sorry. I can't stop the poison's advance. Thank you. Zephyr! The struggle's in your hands now. Oh. Are you there, my son? Yeah, I'm here. I'm here, Dad. Please just... Piece of his ear missing? This can't be. No, it can't. I never. I didn't. And now he's gone. <laughs> well, I guess the true death flag really did happen after all. The fact that he kept fighting with us but wasn't actually joining our party, I mean, that, that seemed like a pretty, like, yep, he's gonna die, probably. I had a feeling we might have a rat among us. But to be menic of all people. I hate how predictable his death was, honestly. So what do we do now? I'm going. Law. That bastard Ganabelt will pay. You have to know that Ganabelt will be expecting us. This is all an obvious trap. I don't give a damn if it is! There's no way I'm letting that bastard get away with this! He's right, you know. Ganabelt. Mess with the wrong people. Alfin, you can't just... Weren't you the one who said you wanted to take on the Lords? Or would you rather go back to Calaglia? I won't allow you to put words in my mouth. All I'm saying is we shouldn't rush things. I don't need any of you coming along. The score is mine to settle. You're not the only one who wants to avenge Zephyr's death. He's right. Besides, if we don't take him on right now, we may never get another opportunity. <sighs> if you're going, that means you're going to need the Blazing Sword. If we do this, we can't afford to make any mistakes. Are you really sure? You can ask us again after we've defeated the Lord. Please, allow me to help you as well. Think of it as an apology for getting you into this whole mess. It's the least I can do. Feel free to use anything in here you might need. Aren't you worried about getting ambushed? Impossible. I built this hideout with my own two hands. Menic. No Ganabelt doesn't know it exists. Then let's go. Time to avenge Zephyr and free the realm's people. You befriended Law, so he's gonna be our next party member. Law's perk. When Law keeps attacking without 
Getting staggered by enemy attacks as concentration builds, raising his attack and elemental attack. This awakened state wears off upon being staggered, or failing to land any hits for a certain period. Shield Buster. Had to reveal a prison tower from the plaza. Man, that friggin' sucks, though, dude. I mean, come on. I like, I, I liked friggin' Zephyr. I think a lot of, I, I have to think a lot of people like Zephyr, honest, honestly. But just like that, just dead. That, ah, eh. oh boy. I swear, man. I forgot to mention this before, but any enemies we go up against with real hard defenses, you just leave them to me. Hard defenses. You mean like enemies with shields and things like that? Shields, shells, armor, whatever. When you attack those kinds of enemies from the front, your blows mostly get blocked, right? Sure. So you're saying you have a counter? It's nothing fancy. Let's just say I have a knack for busting open tough, sturdy stuff. It's hard to explain, but I focus my energy and then hit a specific point with everything I've got. If I do it right, their defenses come crumbling down. Really? But without Astral Arts, how could you possibly... If he says he can do it, then he can do it. We can trust him. <sighs> Thanks, Alfin. Although, between you and me, right now there's nothing I want to bash in more than Ganabelt's stupid smug face. I think you'll get your chance soon enough, Law. Yeah, no kidding, right? <coughs> we definitely need to smash his face in as as punishment for his crimes. So he's got Beast Fist as weapon. He's got a bureau uniform. An accessory. I guess we'll give him the grit emblem for right now. Why not? Why the heck not, am I right? Skill panel. I still don't necessarily agree with that, but I guess I'll just put that on right now. There's no reason not to. Right, right, right. Mm. Let me go with that. He's got some skills we gotta put on now too. Attack plus 10. Penetration plus 10. Wall punch to the ground and cause a shockwave to erupt. Increases damage dealt to attacking enemies. Oh. Increase the distance traveled when dodging enemy attacks. Ooh, that, sounds, that sounds pretty good. Increase awakening attack. Pretty increased attack and elemental attack strength while awakened. Uh huh. AG recipient people has. Additional awakening step at the requirements for awakening when a second time is. Uh -huh. Okay, I would say do that one. I would say do that one. <coughs> and that's it. Alright, well, I think uh, we're not at the end of the episode yet, but I think next episode when we get to that, I think we'll go ahead and play as him. For at least the rest of this episode, I'll keep playing as Alfin. But... If you're wondering where we are in the poll polling right now, the Rinwell poll has not come out yet. Though that should come out... Actually, I don't remember what episode that was, honestly. Well, next episode's coming out as of recording. This is episode 7. I am trying to get really far ahead on all my recordings right now, so just to make sure, like, we are good to go on everything for the most part, but... But, uh, yeah, it's gonna be a little while before the Rinwell one comes out, which means it'll be between those three for a bit, and then... It shouldn't take too long before it ends up being between them, too. Uh, what was that skit called? It was called... Something. So societal Submission. After all that, how can these people carry on like nothing happened? Didn't Zephyr's words reach anyone in that whole crowd? The Snake Eyes could be anywhere. People are scared of being reported, so they can't do jack. And speaking from experience, when you spend so much of your life as a slave, you stop even thinking of standing up and fighting. Calabria had a lot of people like that. Well, these people are in no position to demand anything anyway when they've lost the will to fight and need others to protect them. These people have had a hard enough time just keeping the fires lit. No one wants to sacrifice their life without good cause. It is what it is. Once Ganabelt is out of the picture, things in Cislodia are sure to change. Yeah, I hope so. 
It should happen, though. It should happen for sure. So what's the plan? Head to Rival Prison Tower from the Plaza. <coughs> I would make... Oh? Oh, okay. So we just gotta... Wait, actually, wait. Do we have a fast travel point right there? We do indeed. Alright, so let's get over there once we double check some things. I just want to be sure there's no like side quest available. Does not appear to be the case. Do we have a... Uh... Health wise we're fine. Okay. Alright, so get over there. But anyway everyone, I think that next episode where we play as Law will we've actually be... Destination. Oh frick, I was gonna say it's starting right now, but no. Uh, let's talk about Zephyr's death first and then, and then we'll end the episode. Oh jeez. That damn Gerdabelt! I hate him! I'm not seeing very many enemies around. What's going on? They probably know we're not going to run away. And are waiting for us to show up. Well, if it's a fight they want, I'll be more than happy to give them one. They're probably inside the Ravel prison tower in the plaza. That's where the Lord here lives. The same building with the spirit vessel that's gathering all the light, huh? We need to be careful of how we go from here. The fact Ganabelt knew about my healing arts and had that poison ready tells me he's extremely dangerous. He's not dangerous. He's just a rat bastard who's getting what's coming to him. I'm telling you, don't underestimate him. We don't know what else he's got in store for us. One misstep on our part is all it's going to take to give him what he wants. <sighs> You're right. Dad. What were you trying to tell me there at the end? I guess it'll have to stay unspoken and unheard. Like all the other things we never got round to telling each other. Aww. The thing is, how did he get that poison in the Zephyr in the first place? Like, all he, what did he do? Like, all he did was shine the Master Core at him and then he just, like, fell down from poison or something? Like, I don't... I don't quite get that, honestly. But... Oh well. <coughs> it is what it is. Next episode, everyone, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna play as Law and we're gonna be avenging his father. It's gonna be some fun stuff, everyone. It's gonna be some fun stuff. We'll play as him for, I don't know, maybe two or three episodes and just see how, see how he goes about and then we'll go back to basically doing things the normal way, of course. Uh, how do I switch right now? I'll switch right now so I just don't forget about it later. Let's see, boom and a bop, and last but not least, a boom and a bop. There he is, in the flesh, it's Law. Whoa. Look at him go, look at him go. He's just running around in circles and all that stuff. Whoa. Hey everyone, we'll see how he plays next episode. So until then everyone, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye Hello everyone, you've reached the end of this video, but before we go for the day, i just like to give a quick shout out to the tier 4 and 5 channel members, Phoenix Edgeworth, Acheron X2, Menthi, and Meister Papala. Thank you all for being awesome and supporting the channel. If you too would like to also get your name shouted out at the end of each video and live stream, shoutouts are available for all tier 4 and 5 channel members. I hope you all have an awesome day. I'll see you all later.